If, like me, you're a regular career mode player, then you're probably already getting bored and wondering what to do next. You've done your Road to Glory save, you've done the save of your favourite team, and you've also done a save in another country. Now what is there to do? Well, here are five career mode challenges that you should try out in order to make the mode more exciting for you. Number one is Catalonia nationalism. Now, as the title suggests, you pick a team in Catalonia, but you could only sign players from that region. Here are a list of the five teams in FIFA that are in the region of Catalonia. Now, it works like this. If you're signing a real player, obviously they have to be on Catalonia. But if you want to sign a Youth Academy player, then it's slightly different. Now, after a quick Google, I found out that Catalonia is roughly 16% of the area of Spain. So that means you have a one in six chance. What you should do then is go onto Fruit Machine, put five as Spain, one option as Catalonia, and for every youth player that you go to sign in your first team, you first have to use the Fruit Machine to decide. If it lands on Catalonia, great, you can bring him in. If it lands on Spain, discard him now. See how far you get into that and whether or not you like it. And if you want a challenge, you're probably best not to pick Barcelona. Number two is the Golden Journeyman. Now, you may have heard of a normal journeyman save where you bounce around from club to club. This is a little bit different. In this challenge, what you have to do is win the top division in a different nation every year from the first season to the 15th and final season. Now, if you want a tip, you're better off starting in an obscure nation and working your way up because you won't be able to get the job offers from the obscure nations if you started in a bigger nation such as Spain or England, Germany, Italy, etc. If all goes well, by the end of the career, you should have won 15 different top division league trophies in 15 different nations. Challenge number three is Calciopoli Reborn. Now, for those of you who don't know, in the 2006-2007 season, Juventus were actually relegated and given a 12-point deduction as part of a match-fixing scandal. They were relegated to Serie B. Now, your objective in this is to swap your team from the first division in whatever nation you are to the second division. Now, obviously you can't have points deductions in FIFA, so I've altered the requirements slightly. You actually have a transfer embargo set on you, which lasts for three seasons, which means you can only sign either free agents or players from your youth academy. You cannot sign loan or anyone on a permanent deal for the first three seasons of your career mode challenge. Now, it took Juventus five years after the relegation to win the Serie A. Can you do it in five seasons of your career mode? Challenge number four is England's Super Global League. Now, this is slightly a road to glory, but with a massive twist. Swap all the teams out of England that don't fit the bill for the highest rated teams. So, for example, start with five star rated teams in the Premier League and work your way down in star ratings until it gets to League Two. Start as the worst team in League Two and try to win the Premier League. And finally, challenge number five is Mass Exodus. The objective is this, try to sell every player that the club has originally. Then you have to play a newly signed player in your career mode in every position, every starting 11 player and also every substitute in every game of the season. Don't worry if you can't sell a player because either he's just transferred or you can't find a buyer, that's fine. But as long as you don't play them, they all have to be new signings playing in every minute of every game of the season and the career mode. Then see if you can still live up to the objectives that were set for you at the start of the season by the board. That brings the video to an end. If you've enjoyed the content, please like and subscribe if you aren't already. I really appreciate it. I've been Bromo18 and I will see you next time.